architecture. So please, without any, without further delay, join me in welcoming Raja Shahadi. Thank you very much. Thank you, Director Amos and Professor Gilbert Ashkar for these introductions and congratulations to SOAS on its centenary. 50 years ago, almost to the day, I sat with my father, Aziz Shahadi, as he dictated and I typed on my manual typewriter a plan for ending the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. The plan had its core the establishment of a Palestinian state alongside Israel, following the lines of the 1947 partition scheme with East Jerusalem as its capital. The question of refugees and refugee compensation to be resolved according to the principles laid down in the UN Resolution 194 regarding the right of return. The plan had the support of some 50 Palestinian leaders in the West Bank and the Gaza Strip. However, it was neither accepted nor even considered by the Israeli government, which had since the start of the occupation been dodging one peace offer by the Palestinians and the Arab states after another. And in, and in the words of historian Avi Raz, practicing a policy of deception. The PLO, which was just emerging and finding its feet, did not respond to this initiative. As time passed, most of the PLO supporters of the plan were assassinated by Israel, amongst whom were my father, Isam Sartawi, Saeed Hamami, Naim Khadr, and Azeddin Qalaq. Now, 50 years later, it is what the PLO and most countries of the world are calling for. How much suffering we would all have been spared had it gone through then.